What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. I thought for today we would do kind of a sit down chatty fashion type video instead of a shopping haul because I don't know I don't do these enough and I feel like I just get really inspired and I love looking at fashion and photos and other people's like art and creativity which really inspires me as well so I want to add a little bit more of like chatty fashion videos to my channel and I hope you guys like it as well. So I figured I would just um, go through my Pinterest board, I have my phone here, and we'll chat about what I'm inspired by on my Pinterest board. I'm gonna put the screen recording right over here on this side. So here is my winter 23-24 Pinterest board. I have a lot so I'm not gonna be able to chat about everything, but I'm just gonna kind of like pick up different ones that I see. I really loved this pink hat right here. Not so much the rest of her outfit, but I love that huge bucket hat. And actually, um, one of my friends on Instagram and TikTok, she makes amazing content. You guys should definitely follow her. She actually makes these type of hats. And she has them in really beautiful colors. And they're just like big and oversized and super fluffy. I loved these pants. They're so sick. And I like that she's kind of doing a print mixing with the cheetah shoes. And then obviously her pants have a ton of like different prints in them. It's almost like a patchwork type print, but I don't think that it's different patches. I think it's like printed on the pants. And I just think that the colors are really cool and fun. I don't, I wonder if that's like a denim material or what kind of, they look like they're jeans just in the patchwork print, which is super cool. Sorry if you guys can hear my puppy. She's in her crate and sometimes she cries a little bit before she settles down I just put her in there that's why because we were playing so she's like all amped up she needs to settle down and then I I saw this kind of photo and I I don't know why I have all the elements of this outfit like the furry jacket and the cowboy boots and the trucker hat but I would never think to put a trucker hat with a furry jacket with cowboy boots all together I just think she looks really cool she has the cute little like ribbons in her hair and I don't know, I liked I liked that combo, although I would have never put them together. Loving the shoes on this one, like the silver pointy toed, they look like they're like kitten heels or something, just with that exaggerated pointy toe in the silver color is gorgeous. This is also something I'm really liking, which I've mentioned to you guys recently. Well, I love the big bomber jacket, that's really fun and kind of like a cool color, but I really like the wash of this denim it's kind of like what i was talking about before not super blue jeans these ones are almost i've been getting into like the green wash that almost looks like they have grass stains on them or like like a green tint but these ones are almost like a beige like a beigey brown like not super blue denim i feel like it's a little bit more of like that grunge style and i really like that right now okay this is just really cute with the pointy toe shoes and like the off the top shoulder tops i've gotten a few of those recently i haven't worn them wet yet but i'm i want to oh my gosh these are so cute hold on tegan wants in i'm gonna let her in and we'll talk about this these these cheetah print denim pants are so cute because not only are they cheetah print but they also have like the carpenter style pockets on the side with the little carpenter style like hammer holder thing next to her pocket right there and I just thought that was so cute. I loved it. And it looks like she has it with a cute little Fendi bag and is that a pinstripe blazer? Okay, next up. Also really loving this. Again, with this denim, it's like this beigey wash, not super blue, like grungy style with a wide leg and the square toe boot. And then I really like the belt, like chunky belt over the top, not in the buckles, not in the loops, with the furry jacket that everyone's wearing. Just really cute. I loved that. I've talked about this a ton of times, but the bags with like a million chains and keychains and necklaces. This one has like a key lock has all sorts of fun stuff attached. I'm just so into that. I think it's really cute and really fun to accessorize. And then I also love this striped. I don't love the shoes with these pants. Like the way that it balloons out at the bottom isn't my favorite, but I really do like the striped chunky sweater. 
with the cargos. Like I think that that's a cool juxtaposition. It's cool that she styled it with a tie. I don't think I would rock it with the tie, but I think that she looks like a cool girl. Okay, these, again, the same thing. Obviously Pinterest knows what I like or like I'm saving a lot of them. Look at these beigey, they're blue, but they're like beige wash jeans so cute wide leg with like not blue they're like almost tan i love those i think they're super cute and then i've also noticed this i've been really liking the cuffs at the bottom especially of dark jeans but just really cuffed at the bottom pants no one else has talked about that or i haven't seen anyone that i've followed that talk about different fashion trends and i've not seen anyone mention the grungy jean wash or the cuffed pants at the bottom but this she looks fabulous i love her tinted colored sunglasses like kind of that funky retro 70s style sunglass with the furry sweater instead of like a furry jacket but that one's like really furry gives it the same vibe and then those freaking pants with the huge cuffs at the bottom is so cool and then also this girl like love the pants even with the shoes like her shoes oops sorry it's the shoes are like silver square-toed pumps and then the pants are like carpenter style pants and then she cuffed the shit out of them at the bottom and I think it looks freaking awesome. I love that outfit. I just really like those pants. Okay, this girl is also fabulous. I don't know. Oh, it's for Trina Turk and I love the print mixing on this one with the like gigantic size houndstooth jacket but with plaid pants and the plaid pants are such a cool color i love that kind of like putrid green color mixed with like a maroon or like a purpley dark, dark burgundy and pink like that combo of pant plaid is so freaking fabulous and then i love the huge accessory of the floral flower on the top very good this is also fun too. I don't know if her pants are camo, but I thought the pants, the like printed pants with the striped shirt looked kind of cool in the print mixing. Again, I love this like striped and that fluffy, like the fluffy texture on this little sweater. I think that this is one of the like boleros that goes just like on the top half of your chest and then you wear a shirt underneath it. So it just kind of goes on this part. But that fluffy fabric looks so soft and nice and i love the colored stripes and then i also this i gagged when i saw this like this freaking jacket is stunning stunning that same texture that's like that light fluffy material in this plaid and those colors and the fit like literally everything about this jacket is gorgeous it's a dream jacket for me beautiful love how it like belts at the waistline so it really like brings in the waist and just how it folds over itself oh my god it's freaking beautiful okay this as well look at this dress this dress is so freaking cool it almost looks like somebody made it like handmade i don't know but patchwork but not only is it patchwork it's freaking laces different lace patchwork and the way that it fits the model's body, like it's kind of like tight in the right places, but has a little give in the other places. And then the bottom, how it just kind of like tulips down. It reminds me of a tulip, the way that it kind of like goes down and drapes. So stunning. What a work of art. I also thought this was really cool because the colors of the scarf are similar to the colors in the purse. And the purse has all those like really cool, I don't know if they're like buttons or like different pieces coming out to make it like a 3D effect on the bag. And it has a lot of like silver beads and stuff too. And then, oh, I thought that the, I thought that the scarf was on the bag, but I think it's actually tied onto her wrist. So the way that she's holding the bag, the scarf drapes with the bag, but I just think that those two prints together because like the bag is all white with black details and then the scarf is all black with the white floral details. It just looks mwah, beautiful together. Okay, this was a fun way to tie a scarf that I haven't seen many people doing. I've seen a lot of just the normal like ties 
being worn and then like the ties turned into the skirts or the vests but I haven't seen anyone loop it like that so I thought that was just fun and then this dress I have noticed all of the different like John Paul Gaultier and different designers doing a lot of like body type prints like the ones that look like they're showing like your body figure on the print and I think it's really cool I absolutely love it I actually have one of the John Paul Gaultier shirts that are like that it's a dupe um, but it's kind of like with all the little dots on it I really like that and I've even seen the ones that look like it's like a bra or like a bustier printed on the shirt so a lot of like body and lingerie prints onto other clothes but this one was really pretty too like the way that it like has the top half of her body and then it looks like she's wearing a skirt on the dress I just thought it was a really unique looking dress okay some super simple outfits but I just think they're cute staples like the brown denim she looks like she has long legs too dang she has long legs and then like just the nude top it's nothing groundbreaking but I just thought it was cute together again with the leopard and then the bright orange kind of more of a fall color but I think it really works for winter as well super cute I never do this but it looks so cute when people do and I should try it because I feel like I'd be into it I just never think to do it it's just the cute summery clog heels with the colored socks I know so many people do that I just haven't tried it yet but I feel like I would try it there's some things I like on other people that I don't like on myself and then there's some things that I'm just like I just haven't I don't naturally think that way so I have to like put it in my like noted I'm gonna try that out again with those same colored denim kind of grungy greenwash denim and then this is interesting oh it's a scarf I almost thought she had a hoodie underneath her sweater but it's a scarf and I like how her hair kind of looks a little bit like crimpy and messy I don't know if it, that's curls or natural wave but like she just looks casual but really cute love those jeans and then oh my goodness sorry my app just died okay this freaking bag again it's so cool it's like so over dramatic I love it it has like a bazillion pins on it like all sorts of just different like kind of like punk rocky looking pins and skulls and all sorts of things stars and studs I love this this is is that a wrench there's even like a wrench a a coach wrench I don't know but that bag is just really cool and definitely the vibe and then here's a little bit more like fun kitschy one with all of the little like stuffed animals hanging off of it and more like key change which I think is also very cute this bag super cool love the zebra print I actually have a similar bag it's not as good but it's a it is pony hair and it's a zebra print and I haven't worn it in a long time so maybe this will get me to bring it out and then just really cool with that velvet on her pants and then her jacket is like furry inside and she flipped it up all really high so you can see more of the fur on the arm I just thought that that was kind of a cool detail and colors together okay oh this was fun I mean I wouldn't do these colors like this is a little bit like Halloweeny but I just thought it was cute that they detailed the boots with ribbons on there very fun and a way to like customize I feel like customization of your outfits or clothes to show your individuality is super in like just little things that are little small details I'm predicting that 2024 is going to be the year of like accessories accessorizing things like anklets belly chains jewelry hats just more plain stuff with a bunch of accessories that's what I'm predicting <laughs> a bunch of the bags with the cute bows and accessories we've talked about that for so many different videos this was fun this looks like it's like a vintage underskirt like black tights and then like chunky like bad girl boots and a black corset but like the the just the juxtaposition between her hardcore boots and her lacy skirt is so cool I love that that I have saved here these freaking shoes are gorgeous I saw that they have a similar pair of these from Steve Madden like a dupe pair and mwah, I need them I saw that someone said that they were at Nordstrom Rack and if I find these freaking shoes at Nordstrom Rack I'm getting them they're so cool I love all the buckles the buckles remind me of the Mew, the Mew Mew ballet flat that have all the buckles on top but these are just more my style than the ballet flat 
because the pointy toe and the sling back, I just feel like I would wear these a lot over the Mew Mews, but I do like the Mew Mew Ballet Flats as well. They're very cute. Love this pair of denim. They're almost like gray and cute with the like vest underneath the jacket with like the funky sunglasses, funky colored lenses. I love those. Any style of like the funky colors I'm into. And then the big rosette, very cute. Oh, okay, this is super cool. I love this like Western boho kind of style. Like her boots are like dingy and like worn in, but they look really authentic. I can't stand a cheap looking cowboy boot. That is one thing about me. There's so many cowboy boots out there that were like really popular a few years ago and all of the brands made cowboy boots and the ones that look like they're like cheap tacky, I can't do the cheap tacky like forever 21 or like fashion nova cowboy boots like i feel like they have to look like an authentic cowboy boot for me to like them personally or else i just think they look kind of corny um but i love her cowboy boots they have studs at the top but they're like worn in even her pants like have a bunch of like stains and rips on them but it just looks really like cool and organic and then obviously her tattoos and her jewelry together mwah, so cool she looks like she's a cool person <laughs> Again, with the sho socks and the shoes, I follow this woman on Instagram and she's like a fashion lady. Like she has, she's really in the fashion New York scene. I forget her name, but she has super cool outfits sometimes. And I just liked that her shoes and her socks cute together. Here she is again with the socks and the shoes and kind of like that ripped shirt. I don't know, she, she makes cool outfits a lot of times. Oh, cute with that little like I don't know what the style of this hat is called but it's almost like it reminds me of like a British like paperboy hat or something that might be the wrong name but she looks cute like she's all bundled up but she's got her sunglasses on with her little bob her jacket looks like it has some like unique patches on it and then she has some like arm warmers or like finger warmers and then her Uggs I don't know she just looks cute I like that little hat she made that outfit look adorable. What else? I'm sure we've all seen this photo. Kylie Jenner rocking the camo with the like aviator bomber jacket and Uggs. I feel like that's just such a basic outfit, but it looks cool. And then this girl's kind of cool. She's got some like green cloggy looking shoes on and some, I don't know if those are sweats or like comfier looking um pants but i really think that the interesting part of her outfit is that really long i don't know if that's a jacket or a robe i guess it is kind of like a long trench coat and then she has her hair tucked into her turtleneck which i think just gives kind of like an effortless look she looks cool Okay, this is kind of fun with the cargo pants and she has it tied in a little bit so you can see her shoes better, like cinched in with those little clips. And then the striped shirt, like super simple and easy. I can make all of that myself, but I just thought it looked cool. I never put those together for some reason. Oh, I've seen a lot of this too. This is also something that not too many people have talked about, I've noticed, but I've seen a lot of it on the like necklaces, um, on like ties of things, like the straps and on rings is they're using watches, watch faces and watches as like putting it on other places that you wouldn't traditionally see. So obviously they put this one on like the shoes, which is really cool. I don't know how functional this is, but I just think it looks like a work of art. Like it's very cool and interesting and different. But yeah, I've seen a lot in like necklaces and all sorts of like other, they're using watches in all sorts of creative ways, which I've noticed a lot of and I think is really fun. again 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 with the cool not blue grungy different washes of denim here and i don't know this girl just looks like sassy and fun i love her like overlined lips with her like bright white hair i think she looks great these shoes okay these have nothing to do with fall and winter i don't know how they got into this board they're probably meant for my springboard but i love these shoes they're like chunky they were only $70, that's not even very expensive. Like the chunky wood, oh, they're from Free People. The chunky wood heel with the cute strappy top. 
I am obsessed. Like, very interesting and unique carving of the heel. What else? Oh my gosh, freaking red cowboy boots. I want them so bad. They've been on my thrift wish forever. I might have to just like seek them out on Poshmark or something like that, thread up. But I want a pair of red cowboy boots like that. I just think they're so cool and I'm never, I haven't found them yet. I haven't manifested them at thrift yet. But look at those ones, they're like metallic. Those ones aren't really cowboy boots, but they're cool. I want some red boots. Okay, this lady also, I think her name is Grace. I also follow her on Instagram and she lives in New York and she has the most awesome style, even though she's a more like mature woman. She wears the coolest freaking outfits. Let me know if you want me to do a whole style breakdown of like some more like mature women that have amazing style. Cause I have like three or four of them that I can think of off the top of my head that are like a little bit older, but they wear cool shit. But I love her, look at her, she's freaking awesome. She's rocking that like army jacket that was really in a few years ago with the Acne Studios scarf. Her like fun, funky white sunglasses. She's just stunning. She makes some cool outfits. Okay, this is fun. I really liked this outfit because of a few things. Okay, she's wearing, it, I don't know if that's considered a penny lane, but it's like a long jacket with the fur um, around the neckline. And then she has a printed shirt on, but it looks like it's sheer and thin. But then she put a vest over the sheer thin shirt. And I think that that looked really cool. And they both have print on them, like the bottom and the vest, both printed. And then her shoes look like they also have a similar color theory, a similar color tone as the vest and the shirt, but a different print. So like lots of print mixing, but in the same color family, very fun. Okay, this girl too, super cool. She's wearing some summery things that she made into a fall look or maybe spring look. She has a long sleeve shirt on, but then on top of that, she wore a like normal um, like knit looking t-shirt, button up polo, polo type shirt. And then on top of that, she has that cool like bralette looking shirt. Okay, this chick looks cool. She's wearing a dress over jeans. And then like it has some printing on her t-shirt that she's wearing underneath the dress. I think the dress and jean things looks kind of cool sometimes. Sometimes I hate it, sometimes I love it. But in that case, I loved it. That was really neat. Camera's dying, I guess that means that this is over. Oh, I got to the end of my board though. So yeah, perfect. Here's last one. We'll end off with Miss Grace. Isn't she fabulous? We gotta do a whole video of my mature, fabulous ladies. Look at, even the way she's posing is so awesome with her red Balenciaga bag striped with the cargos and her sunglasses. She is so cool. All right, you guys, since my camera's dying, I'm just gonna say goodbye now. I hope you guys enjoyed just sitting down and chatting with me. Let me know if you want more videos like this because I just really like to talk about fashion. I have some Instagram saves. We can do um, some of those videos again or just like talk about what we're liking what we're seeing from the upcoming season so let me know i love you guys so much thank you thanks for watching a more casual video and um i'll see you guys next time bye